Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. My name is Circle and in this video we are going to be going over some of the new the, the new character in the update 1.3.0, which is Mail and Lee. We are also going to be later covering Beast and Maleficent, but that's going to be in the next two weeks. So, Mail and Lee, if you don't know, is from the new movie Turning Red and came out in the up in, in Disney Melee Mania in the update 1.3.0. And it's a pretty powerful character. Definitely, definitely one of the more powerful characters now after the update. But I don't think it is too overpowered and is just about in the right spot. And I think if all characters were about this skill, this power level, I guess, then that would be really nice. Just, it's a pretty balanced character, but still pretty good and pretty entertaining to use. And moving on to the skills and all the abilities. Malin Lee's health is 4,850. Her main attack is talk to the paw. Damage is 500 to 580 times 3. Range is short. Cooldown 0.75 seconds, which is a pretty good base attack. The ability is Panda Rage. Knockback strength is strong. Damage is 950. Range is medium. Cooldown is 10 seconds. That's a pretty good ability. Knockback is always pretty nice, especially for shooters, but even on a melee, it's still pretty good. Moving on to the ultimate pandemonium. The damage is 750, range is short, cooldown is 36 seconds, and knockback strength is medium. That's a pretty powerful one, especially in the new game mode, or blessed. Now, overall, Malin Lee is a pretty good character powerful like I said before and really you can use I'd say it's best used as a uh, almost a similar character to Timon from before from date before that was the main like support more fast character I think it's a fast paced character especially with the lower health and she really her main I guess Pro is the fact that there's the pandemonium ultimate you can stand in a, a spotlight and just run around in a circle and they can't get in the spotlight uh, you still can die and really shooters I think are one of the only ones that can really do that though you're a little bit faster as well and it really helps in orb blast you can just press that and then run through the orb get to the end team deathmatch I mean you know you can get the enemies away from your teammates or you can uh, just deal damage to them since it does deal a good amount of damage it deals 750 that's not too bad the ability is you know pretty nice you can like jump forward it's good to get getting to the spotlight faster chasing down runners and really doing anything you need to do with the jumping one, especially with the fairly short cooldown. 10 seconds isn't too bad. It's always nice when you have that extra mobility and movement speed. Speaking of movement speed, her movement speed isn't that bad. It's around about mid-tier. Same thing with the health. The attack, I think... It's this is really one of those ones where you're going to want to run in, quickly hit, and then just try and get out. Unless you have uh, your ultimate. And I think the main attack, the talk to, your, talk to the paw attack, is pretty good. And especially with a fairly short cooldown of 0 0.75 seconds. You can really, like hit pretty hard kind of I mean of course you still need it's not like the hardest hitter or anything but it's a pretty mobile character definitely definitely a welcome addition to the game I think it's a good mix between like maybe uh, m like Ralph and Timon where it takes the good parts of both of them 
and then just makes them slightly weaker and puts them into a character. I definitely think this is one of those characters that if you get it and you you enjoy using her, then you can. It, it's definitely in one that you can win with. Not that you can't win with some of the other characters. Just I think this is one of the ones that's gonna be in the top characters after the update. So yeah, that's that's it for this video, everybody. I hope you have enjoyed this video. I'll see you all in the next one. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you all later. Goodbye.